And there's against Romero. 1 0 Colombia. Comprehensively beaten. First up for Argentina is their captain, Lionel Messi. Well, Ospina was uh, comfortably man of the match over the 90 minutes. Is he destined to be the hero during the shootout as well? Messi, who missed four penalties for Barcelona last season. Scores here with consummate ease. Goes the same way as James, and it's 1-1. Well, they've both made it look very easy. Now, Radamel Falcao. And there's just one shot on target in the whole of the group stage. Well, he's rifled that into the roof of the net. Romero a lot closer this time. I think he knew which way Falcao was going. He was close, but... Uh, well, can I hit that with some force? Now, Ezekiel Garay, the Zenit defender. He never scored a goal for Argentina, but he's stepping up to take his second penalty for La Albi Celeste. And Garay smashes it home. Again, Ospina went the right way, but uh, no one, no goalkeeper was saving that. Oh, it's a good job there's a net there, because otherwise someone's head was coming off behind the goal. Cuadrado of Chelsea for Colombia does exactly the same no chance for either goalkeeper with any of these penalties superbly dispatched Three-two to Colombia. Benega for Argentina. Late sub in the match. Goes low. Beats Ospina. Three-three. Again, Ospina knew which way it was going, but it was so expertly placed right in the corner. Even at full stretch, and couldn't get there. Luis Nuriel, late sub for Colombia. Oh, a wild miss! from Muriel, and it's the first miss of the shootout. Well, he looked at the penalty spot, but he skied it horribly. And the 24-year-old from Sampdoria is the first to miss, and miss by an absolute mile.
Well, two goals stacked one on top of the other. I think that would still have missed. Lovetsi, another late sub in the 90 minutes. Against Ospina. Oh, just. Place to perfection. How close has Ospina here? Well, you can't get... <laughs> I mean, he's hit that off the inside of the post. That's as good as it gets. Now, he has to score here. Carbona. Has to put this away to keep Colombia in it. And he has just... How has Romero not saved it? Goodness me, it's gone right underneath him. This is not a good penalty from uh, the young man. Right under the knee of Romero. 4-4. But Lucas Bilia has the chance to put Argentina through. If he scores, it's all over. The Lazio midfielder steps up and misses! Oh, the drama goes on. That was a long way wide from Lucas Pelia. Well, the Colombia fans were in despair a moment ago. Now they believe again. It's all square once more. Now we're into the players that didn't step up the first time. Juan Camilo Zuniga, the fullback for Colombia. Oh, it's saved! Romero goes the right way and beats it clear. And it's advantage to Argentina again. Not close enough to the corner. The perfect height for Romero. It's a good save. So once again, it's this penalty to put Argentina through. Marcus Rojo of Manchester United missed staggering no one wants to win this shootout Rojo went for power and smashed the crossbar goalkeepers out of the game completely he's on the deck but he couldn't keep it down the fourth miss of the shootout and still Colombia are hanging on. Now it's the centre-back, Heysen Murillo, the only man to score in this competition for Colombia so far. Oh, my goodness! That's the worst one of the lot. Oh, horrible moment for Murillo, the 23-year-old. I think that's even higher than Muriel's. Now Tevez. A third chance 
for Argentina to go through to the last four. Just sealed a return to his native Argentina with Boca Juniors. Can he celebrate with the winning penalty here? Tevez scores! And Argentina are through to the Copa America semi-finals. Scenes of jubilation. They will certainly feel they deserve it over the course of the match. This time four years ago, they were beaten on penalties when they hosted the tournament by the eventual winners, Uruguay. Here, they have come through the shootout to reach the last four and a possible semi.